In this video, I will show you how to complete the initial setup using Orbitz Web's wizard and also how to activate the application. First, click on Access Orbit. Log in using your admin user and the password you find in the manual. And now we can complete the first step of the wizard. Here I have to first check if the host name is correct, add the application URL to be used in my environment. This is actually a crucial step because different Sinaseguros features use this URL. After that, we can choose a default language, the time zone, and fill in the NTP and DNS settings. Please note that a successful configuration requires Sinasegura's server to successfully access both the NTP and DNS servers listed here. A pop-up window will ask you to confirm these changes. Click Yes. You will get a second message saying the new settings are now being applied. Having completed this step, we can move on to the backup. So backup should be enabled. But I won't configure neither the video backup nor the remote partitions today. You can find more information on them in other videos. Finally, I have to choose if this is going to be a standalone or high availability environment. In this example, I'm working in a standalone environment. But look for our other videos to see how to configure high availability environments in Sinasegura. Again, click Yes to confirm these changes. Now that we have covered the wizard's first three steps, I can enable the application. To do so, go to the address bar and delete this part of the URL. Go to Configuration. and toggle on the application. You can now start using Sinasegura's application. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and check the Sinasegura Shorts playlist for more information.